It's a common stigma more people are fighting to change, like Serena Goldsmith, who lives in Oceanside. I was actually diagnosed with bipolar disorder, type 1, 23 years ago. She's seen a lot of progress since then, but says there's still a lot that needs to be done. For three and a half years, she's been working to help others recover as a peer counselor at the nonprofit Mental Health Systems Office in the North County. So it was actually the first time when I applied for a job that that was an asset, that my mental health diagnosis was something to be proud of and something to see as a strength. New research from the RAND Corporation shows most people with a mental illness still face discrimination in California, so it makes sense the vast majority would hide their problem from coworkers, classmates, even family. And you feel frustrated, angry, sad. Dr. Anthony Jensen says the Green Rose campaign is designed to encourage people who have sought treatment just like any other illness and remind others just how common depression, anxiety, and schizophrenia can be. And so there are many people around us um, who, are, who we work with or are in our family uh, who may be suffering or have a period in their life where they suffer from a mental illness, and we need to be open to supporting them and reach out to them.